yo el, yo tu. Blow ye the shofar in Sion, and sound an alarm in my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble, for the day of Yahua comes, for it is nigh at hand. A day of darkness and of gloominess, a day of clouds and of thick darkness, as the morning spread upon the mountains, a great people and a strong. There has not been ever the like, neither shall be any more after it, even to the years of many generations. A fire devours before them, and behind them a flame burns. The land is as the garden of Eden before them, and behind them a desolate wilderness. Yea, and nothing shall escape them. The appearance of them is as the appearance of horses, and as horsemen, so shall they run. Like the noise of chariots on the tops of mountains shall they leap, like the noise of a flame of fire that devours the stubble, as a strong people set in battle array. Before their face the people shall be much pained. All faces shall gather blackness. They shall run like mighty men, they shall climb the wall like men of war, and they shall march every one on his ways, and they shall not break their ranks. Neither shall one thrust another, they shall walk every one in his path. And when they fall upon the sword, they shall not be wounded. They shall run to and fro in the city, they shall run upon the wall, they shall climb up upon the houses, they shall enter in at the windows like a thief. The earth shall, shall quake before them. The heavens shall tremble. The sun and the moon shall be dark. And the stars shall withdraw their shining. And Yahua shall utter his voice before his army. For his camp is very great. For he is strong that executes his word. For the day of Yahuwah is great and very terrible, and who can abide it? Therefore also now, says Yahuwah, turn ye even to me with all your heart, and with fasting, and with weeping, and with mourning, and rend your heart, and not your garments, and turn unto El Yahuwah, Elohechem, for he is gracious and merciful, slow to anger, and of great kindness, and repents of the evil. Who knows if he will return and repent, and leave a blessing behind, even a meat offering, and a drink offering, unto Yahua Elohechem. Blow the shofar in Sion, sanctify a fast, call a solemn assembly. Gather the people, sanctify the assembly, Assemble the elders, gather the children, and those that suck the breasts. Let the bridegroom go forth of his chamber, and the bride out of her closet. Let the priests, the ministers of Yahua, weep between the porch and the altar. And let them say, Spare your people, O Yahua, and give not your heritage to reproach that the heathen should rule over them. Wherefore should they say among the people, Where is their Elohim? Then will Yahuwah be jealous for his land and pity his people. Yea, Yahuwah will answer and say unto his people, Behold, I will send you eth grain and wine and oil, and ye shall be satisfied therewith. And I will no more make you a reproach among the heathen, but I will remove far off from you at the northern army, and will drive him into a land barren and desolate, at with his face toward the east sea, and his hinder part toward the utmost sea. And his stink shall come up, 
and his ill savor shall come up, because he has done great things. Fear not, O land, be glad and rejoice, for Yahua will do great things. Be not afraid, ye beasts of the field, for the pastures of the wilderness do spring. For the tree bears her fruit, the fig tree and the vine do yield their strength. And children of Sion rejoice and be glad in Yahua Elohechem, because he gives to us eth the righteous teaching, which descends on us like a teaching rain and a latter rain in the first of the year. And the floors shall be full of wheat, and the fats shall overflow with wine and oil. And I will restore to you at the years that the locust has eaten, the canker worm and the caterpillar and the palmer worm, my great army which I sent among you. And ye shall eat in plenty, and be satisfied, and praise at the name of Yahua Elohechem, that has dealt wondrously with you. And my people shall never be ashamed. And ye shall know that I am in the midst of Yashadael, and that I am Yahua Elohechem, and none else. And my people shall never be ashamed. And it shall come to pass afterward that I will pour out eth my ruach upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, your old men shall dream dreams, your young men shall see visions, and also upon the servants and upon the handmaids in those days will I pour out eth my ruach. And I will show wonders in the heavens and in the earth, blood and fire and pillars of smoke. The sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before the great and the terrible day of Yahua come. And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of Yahua shall be delivered for in Mount Sion and in Yerushalayim shall be deliverance, as Yahua has said, and in the remnant whom Yahua shall call. <laughs>